And welcome back to beautiful Lions Field here in Waconia. This is the Junior Legion game. These guys are about sophomore age in high school right now. Um, we have Waconia playing St. Michael Albertville. This game will wrap up in just a little bit, and then the Waconia Lakers and the St. Bonnie Saints will take the field. First pitch set for 8 o'clock. A beautiful night for a game to be played underneath the lights. And as you know, town ball is a family affair. You know, you have brothers and dads and sons playing. And tonight I have Ryan and Will Naughton with us to talk a little bit about their relationship and, of course, what town ball means to them. Thank you so much, guys, for having us and for talking with us tonight. So, Ryan, I'll start with you. Tell me a little bit about um, this team, what it means to you. You're a pitcher, a designated, designated hitter. How long have you been playing for this team, and how good does it feel to get out on the field? Yeah, I've been playing for this team for about eight years. Um, my you know, amateur career is 20-plus years, so it's been a great you know, nearing the end. But playing for this team and this community, you can't beat it. Yeah. It's, it's just so special. Every time you're out there, it's fantastic to see the community and the crowds come. I can imagine you have two small children and I know life is very busy and this has to make your summer incredibly busy you know, <laughs> managing all the schedules and getting Will to his games as well but it's got to be worth it right or you wouldn't keep <laughs> it doing absolutely it. is <laughs> worth it so the way that this started with Will was really to get him to come with me so I could still play and everything at home would still be okay mm -hmm. uh, but you know again as it's nearing the end I sit and I think of you know, who brought me into baseball and you know, my, my family and my dad coached me and then I just had great coaches growing up. I had Kurt Russell at Tartan and he's been there for 20 plus years. I had you know, Jerry Harrigan growing up as well. Uh, Ron Adams, North St. Paul, 30 years there. Yeah. Dennis Denning at St. Thomas. So then when Will can come with me uh, to these games, it's just so special That's for great. me to have him uh, you know, be able to help me and I can talk to Will and yeah. it's just great. It's that's, great to share. It's a great one on one time and Will you're a bat boy. That's a lot of responsibility. Tell me what your job is. Um, it's to get the bats after they get a hit or if it's like they're running to the base and they get out but I grab the bats and bring them back into the dugout. Do you ever get stressed? Sometimes. Sometimes, yeah. When it's a radio game, I could. Yeah, it's a lot of stuff to keep track of. But are the guys nice to you? Yeah. Yeah. Who's your favorite baseball player? My dad. Aww. And do you want to play for the Lakers someday? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Tell me, you're on a baseball team this summer. Yeah. What team is it? The Wildcats. The Wildcats. How do you think they're going to do? Mm, okay. TBD. To be determined. Okay. Well, I think you guys are going to have a great summer, both here and with the Wildcats. Um, we also want to mention that, Ryan, you have a sandwich that is named after you at the concession stand. Uh, tell me a little bit about that. Yep. So I've been doing barbecue for about 10 years now. We went and competed uh, at Memphis in May, did really well 2017, took third out of about 250 teams, which is phenomenal. Um, and it just coincided to building this. and. I got asked by Jeff Lenz, who runs the concession stand, if I'd help out, do anything. And I said, let's just keep it simple to start. Let's do some bold pork. And then you know, everybody seemed to like it. And we ended up creating this naughty burger, which put the pork on the cheeseburger. And the rest is history. It sounds just, delicious. you got to go try it. And you were a jack of all trades um, as well. All right. So that naughty sandwich is something that Hobie Arteague is going to be talking about in just a little bit. Sounds delicious. We're going to be trying it as well. Um, so look forward to, for that. And then also we want to go to Ian Leonard with a look at the forecast. 